Hi, today I'm going to share with you a way for you to stay safe whenever you're active. I'm Margaret Martin, registered physical therapist, certified strength and conditioning specialist, and I've been working with individuals just like you for over 38 years. You may already know that the three most common osteoporotic fractures that occur are in the spine, the wrist, and the hip. Hip fractures are not only life-changing, but they can be catastrophic. 25% of men and almost as many women who sustain hip fractures die within the first year. I worked with many people over my years on the surgical floor and in rehab. I don't wish it on any of you. So why do hip fractures occur? Let's have a look at the anatomy of the hip. You can see that the hip joint is made up of the acetabulum of the pelvis and the head of the femur on the thigh bone. The neck of the femur is the connecting bridge between the shaft and the femoral head. The neck of the femur has more soft bone or trabecular bone than any other part of the femur, which makes it most susceptible to fracturing. When our bone density is low, the force transmitted from a fall, slip, or trip is unfortunately enough to force a cause a break at the femoral neck. Accidents such as falling off your bike, running for a ball on the court, or taking a tumble skiing create even more force and further increase the risk of a fracture. Each year, hundreds of thousands of people are admitted to hospital with hip fractures. For example, about 76,000 hip fractures occurred in 2021 in the UK. In the US, the number was well over a quarter of a million. Several of my patients fractured their hip in the last year. So we know hip protectors don't stop you from falling, but they do re reduce the risk of a fracture if you wear them. So this got me looking in for the right hip protector for clients who are active and plan to stay active. During my search, I came across a study comparing 18 different hip protectors using a standard mechanical test. The better the hip protector absorbed forces, the better they performed on the test. This translates to better dampening of the forces that are felt on impact, thus providing better protection. There was one company that rose above the rest in the study, the Deloc hip protectors. Their hip protectors scored in the first, second, and third place. So I decided to contact the owner. He kindly shared samples of his hip protectors it was obvious to me that like most hip protectors, his were designed for the elderly. They were bulky and unattractive. Needless to say, they were not popular with many of my clients. After several months of back and forth discussing ways to make them more appealing to active seniors, colors, slimmer pads that offered even better protection, I'm excited to be able to say that Deloc has come up with what I believe is to the best hip protector for the active adult on the market today. They are comfortable, made with breathable 100% cotton. They have slimmer pads that have been tested in Germany and rated for motorcycle grade protection. They're more affordable than their competitors. These hip protectors and shorts are cute enough to wear when working out or under your sportswear when hiking and skiing. They sure make me feel safer when I zip along on my e-bike or play my new favorite sport. They are both comfortable and slim enough to wear under my regular clothing. So whether you're hitting the slopes, the trails, or the court, please keep yourself safe and make hip protectors a part of your active wear. In the description box below, you can find the link to the Deloc hip protectors for active adults. To encourage you all to make strength and balance training, which is also important for protecting you, a regular part of your life, I have a special playlist perfect for you. Stay hip with hip protectors. Play safe and enjoy your senior years.